Hi there, this is um, number two of the bathroom tapes and uh, I remember Bob Dylan had the basement tapes with the band I guess at Big Pink back in the late 60s and this is the bathroom tapes maybe the one and only set of bathroom tapes that you ever see um, first we have Trollo Band, late 60s, McKenna Mendelssohn Mainline this is quite a rare album in Canada here and uh, the album is called Stink great blues album featuring the song Toilet Bowl Blues. And I thought about doing a, a, a washroom theme here, but that's the only one I'm going to include as part of that theme, I think. I picked that up years ago, probably 40 years ago. Big band hits of the 30s, 40s, and 50s by the Enoch Light and the Light Brigade. Living Jazz on Camden, RCA Camden. There's a whole pile of living this, living that. This is the soul of Brazil. I noticed that this the instrument or the musicians on this are actually some of Enoch Light's musicians. Full Swing. This is something like Manhattan Transfer, I think. It's produced by Richard Perry, Planet Records, and you know he produced a whole pile of people back in the 70s and 80s, like the Pointer Sisters and uh, Carly Simon and Streisand, I think, even. Joanne Castle, Ragtime Memories. Joanne Castle used to be the ragtime piano player on the Lawrence Welk show. Cha Cha Cha, RCA Living Stereo, Arthur Murray's Music for Dancing. Another Arthur Murray Music for Dancing, this is uh, on Living Stereo. Mambo, Rumba, Samba, Tango. Arthur Murray's Favorites, Sambas, this is on Capitol though. This one I really liked. It's Tex Beneke and his orchestra with Ray Everly, Marion Hutton and the Modern Airs. It's essentially the Glenn Miller Orchestra, only uh, Tex Beneke took over the band at some point, probably from the 1950s. Wayne and Schuster, Canada's famous comedians of the 50s and 60s, and I think they had more appearances on The Ed Sullivan Show than any other set of comedians. Percussion on Parade. Wall-to-wall -wall stereo. It's on United Artists, Ultra Audio, people like Ferrandi and Tiker. Okay, here's some serious music. This is Night Tide, the Mystic Moods Orchestra. If you're under 18, close your eyes. You open this up and there are a couple there, a picture of a couple getting very romantic. We have Mystic Moods, another one. This one's called Emotions. And in this one, they're becoming even more romantic. They're romantic to the point where they're going to be making babies, I think. And here's the clean Mystic Moods one. No, no, fi no pictures, just listen to the music. The songs are all 60s covers of 60s songs, and it's just... Typical record. Kirby Stone 4, Bangles, Bobbles, Beads, Jimmy Carroll and his orchestra. Okay. Music of the Strip by the Cousins. It looks like a strip tease record. It's in the Parkway label. It's uh, in the same series as my Chubby Checker record. I think this one came out after the Chubby Checker record that I showed a couple of videos ago. Anna Corio presents How to Strip for Your Husband, Music to Make mar Marriage Merrier. I don't know if this one's politically correct, but it's called Gentlemen Be Seated, a Complete Minstrel Show. It's a very strange one, but it's the music or whatever is going to be from the early 1900s or something, late 1800s. Sarah Vaughan, uh, Copacabana, this is on the Pablo label, jazz label. Here's a nice Americana type album. Leonard Bernstein and the New York Philharmonica, the world's 25 greatest all-time marches. And it's a double album on the Columbia Masterworks label. 
Ray Conniff, early Ray Conniff. It'll be this is one of the first stereo albums from Columbia back in the late fifties, probably fifty nine or so. It's uh, his Latin album it's called Say It With Music. This album is Thelma Houston and The Pressure Cooker. I've got the music in me, which is a cover of the song by Kiki D. Big hit song. And this album is a Sheffield Lab direct to disc recording. You know, the musicians on here are some of LA's finest uh, studio musicians, people like Larry Carlton, Jim Gordon, uh, Jim Keltner, um, Larry Nechtel. Earl Grant's Greatest Hits. It's on Decca. Here's a very early Columbia classical album, and it's um, Oscar Levant doing Gershwin's Rhapsody in Blue, an American in Paris. Another Chet Baker in the Mariachi Brass. This one's double shot. It has Dancing in the Street, Ring of Fire. This is a Canadian jazz album. I've played this. It's very well produced. It's on Columbia. Jim Galloway, Keep the Rhythm Going. It's a, it's a really, really good sounding jazz album. Kind of big bend, swingy kind of stuff. Really nice cover. And another Canadian band called another Canadian big band. Spitfire Band in flight. And the Spitfire Band put out a series of recordings in the late 70s, early 80s of all big band covers. Like I said, they're Canadian and, th and they're really excellent albums for this kind of music. Uncle Smokey sings fun songs for the summer crowd. This is a Canadian RCA album, Canadian series. He does a lot of comedy songs on here called uh, like, Oh Boy, Do I Love Bears? Midnight Skinny Dippers, have you ever seen a drunk? Have you ever been as drunk as a skunk and then met one? Uncle Smokey. Thanks for watching.